Okay, drink. You got it. Okay, good. All right, thanks. What you gonna do next? Um, 82 apple. Come on. Let's get it. This is 82 apple, is it? 82 apple. Yeah. Good work, buddy. Thank you. I like you my best. Good work, buddy. I like it myself. Keith? You? Okay, let's pick up the Harvin, go up the ridge, carry them this way, then we'll cut, go on the other side, and then we'll be shooting down this way, and then we'll pick them up left to right. Okay, works for you? For me, it's better if we can shoot from this angle because of the light. Okay, well, then we're gonna have to shoot Susan. No, it won't work. We, she will not let us shoot her right profile. Would you believe that? No, you're gonna let's put her here and then we'll take. Yeah, her we, can work, okay. we can work around it. We can work around it. Tony, Billy. Yeah. Yeah. Looking good, Mike. Yeah, your movies give me a good workout. <laughs> Excuse me, Mike. Um, we'll be doing scene 82A. Um, do you have any questions about it? Uh, no, I've gone over this already. It's okay. Okay, thank you, Thank you. That was really great, Mike. Ah, it's artificial danger. Well, what kind of excitement are you looking for? Real war? Yeah. Uh, oh, yeah? Would you like to come to my room tonight? Now you're being too brave. You ever been raped by a wildcat? No! Oh, yeah? Brian. Sounds all right. Yeah, everything's okay. Okay. Go again. Hey, see that? Okay. What we need now is an explosion right there in front of the hub. One right in front of the door and one behind of the hub. You take your stuff with you. You wire it out already. Hey, see that? How about this? Thank you. I don't like the way the uh, Thai army guy is treating the express. Please, make sure he stops it, okay? All right, I take care of it. In 79, how short were we? 320. Okay. Uh, let's see if we can pick it up in 82 Apple. 82 Apple? Yeah. Yeah, Thanks. okay, got it. Billy, we're ready to do 82 Apple, but we can't shoot it without a leading lady. Do you have any suggestions? She must get caught up in traffic getting out of Bangkok. She'll be here any minute now. Any minute, huh? That's what you said yesterday, and yesterday she was four and a half hours late. Look, Frank, the distributor wanted her, and I'm stuck with her. And I can't recast the film here in the middle of Thailand. You know, you're getting so excited, you're gonna blow a fuse. Relax, pal, I'm just ragging your ass. What do you want me to do, call my mother and complain to her? Huh? <laughs> Yeah. That's terrific. Three hours and 45 minutes. That's better than yesterday. Huh? Come on, Frank. We're going to have to think about it. Come on. Are you going to meet the lady? Really? Well, look who's here. The leading lady herself. You better get a move on her. You might not have a job in her next picture. What makes you think she's going to have a next picture? Very nice of you to join us. Why am I late? Oh, only a couple of hours. I just couldn't wake up this morning. That shoot yesterday really got to me. Okay, okay. Let's just get started. Susan, why don't you get your makeup and get ready? Get your makeup on. Well, at least you have some makeup on already. Yeah. Who was it this time, Susan? The room boy? Why do you ask? Have you had any more luck with the makeup girl? Hmm. Hello, Susan. Hello. I gotta put this body mic on you. Sure, Brian, go ahead. Oh. How are you today? Oh, except for a splitting headache, but everything's okay. Feeling much better. What about yours, Mike? Is it a lot? Yeah, mine's okay. 
Okay. Thank you. Okay, Miss Jackson. Uh, we'll be doing scene 82A. You go up to that hut up there, and you'll be rescued by Mike. Okay? Okay. Okay, thank you. What are we waiting for? Ready. Camera's ready. Testing mic, one, two, three. Testing mic, one, two, three. Sound! Speed! Camera? Rolling! Okay, looking good. Action! What the hell is going on here? We're doing 82A. What are you guys doing here? Hey, Frank, get up! What, what are you doing? Uh, Don't touch me! Frank! Don't touch me! Who the hell are those people? Who are they? Where's the interpreter? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Who are those people? I don't know. Right. down, please. Knock it off. Come on. Give it a break. Okay, everybody. There's nothing we can do here right now. We'll report it to the authorities immediately and let the Thai military handle it. Okay, that's a wrap, everybody. Thank you. Okay, Ben. See that everybody gets back to the hotel safely. All right. The bus is over here now. Let's move out. Okay, Frank. Let's get this leg of yours fixed up and go report this to the United States Embassy in Bangkok. Yeah. I keep it there. Room 701, please. You know, who do you think that we should have gone after him? Kick ass, damn Charlies. Those were no Charlies. 10 11. How do you know? After all the movies we did, I know their costumes. <laughs> all right, all right. Let's go to our room for a drink and we'll talk some more. Yeah, why don't we get cleaned up first? <clears throat> uh, I'm not sure, guys. I think I'll follow later. Okay. Hey, last time I saw him, he was high and tight. You guys know each other? Yeah. We were stationed over here 18 years ago. What was it? 20 years ago. Long time ago, partner. Long time. You know you're in the military, Frank. Well, there are probably a couple of things I don't know about you either. Well, what about this uh, Susan Jackson kidnapping? What do you want me to do about it? Call out the military. Send in a rescue team. Bill, this is Thailand. This is not the United States of America. My hands are tied. All we can do is wait. 
wait. You know how much money it cost me to wait? Money? Well, I presume you're insured. Insured? Who's thinking about insurance? I'm concerned with poor Susan. She'll rot in the jungle. Just imagine us making a movie about the war. They're boxing a bunch of real cutthroats. Cutthroats. <laughs> Stealing our star. Knowing Susan, I doubt they have a lot of fun with her. <laughs> oh, please don't step on my toe. You might break my knee. <laughs> Come on, you guys. You're being real jerks. Nothing to laugh about. Nothing to laugh about? Susan broke her toenails? <laughs> Drowning your frustrations in booze again, Mike, are you? Not really, but there's no work tomorrow. Maybe not. In the meantime, the Thai authorities are doing what they can. I don't expect much, though. But that could take some time. I don't know about you guys, but I could party every night or until she gets back. <laughs> Knock it off. How would you all like to be in her shoes? Think about it. It's just that it's Susan, of all people. Whether you like her or not, it's got nothing to do with it. We came here together, and we're going to leave here together. You got that? We're going to do our damn best to get her out of whatever mess she is in. Yeah, I'm just wondering about Susan. I wonder where she could be right now. Why not? We don't even know where she is. Well, let's find out. I have a suggestion. We get Tram, the Cambodian production coordinator. He might be able to tell us. And I have another suggestion. Have him locate some maps over the region. Anything he can get his hands on. Great, it. Go. I think only place no control. That's a pretty large area, isn't it? Come in. Sorry to disturb you guys. You see, I have uh, two body mics missing. I was wondering if uh, maybe anybody, somebody found it. Might be in my uniform, Brian. Let me check. Was Susan wearing her transmitter when she was in that? Yes, sir. She had one on. I'm, I'm, I'm afraid I might not even see that one again. It was so horrible. I could hear her screaming while she was being dragged away. What would you say the maximum effective range on that transmitter is? Well, I think about 500 yards. 
What would you need to increase that range? I would need a PCM-50 Model 20D, then that would boost my range for another 50 miles or so. Where could you pick one like that up? Well, I think the time that it's at might have one. But they'll never give us one. Well, then we'll have to rip it off, won't we? <laughs> What the hell are you laughing at? Let's rip one off. <laughs> right. um, this is crazy. We just can't go in there and grab the booster. Look, it's crawling with cards. Brian. Just go on with it, yeah. Let's go, Brian. Okay. My weight. Robert, how about it now? Where's your supply room? It, it's over there. Take it easy. Take it easy. Brian, get his gun. What? That gun? Get I his gun. Can... Oh. Take it easy. All right, move it. Move it. Hm. Move your ass, boy. Hmm. It's out of range. We have to get closer. Oh, God. Hey, 
Mike. It's all here to works. Guess what I found? A mini boosting unit. I can use this too. Okay, go ahead. Robert, meet Brian. He's on his way down now. Brian is coming. Let's go back. Do we leave now? Yeah, come on. You! Oh! Come on, come on! Let's go, let's go! Try this. unfriendly circumstance of a fine meeting. Who are you? Oh, I'm sorry. Horo Van Tiu, Patriot leader of the Khmer Rouge. Take her to her quarters and be sure to give her the best of everything. Yes, sir. I estimate it will be about 20 miles east of the Cambodian border. Well, if you are right, then she must be somewhere around here. Then let's go and get her. He's absolutely right. Now or never. It's crazy. You just can't go into Cambodia. Why not? <laughs> We're in movie biz, pal. We can do anything we want to. It's all done with mirrors anyhow. Go on. Yeah, Bye. let's go. <laughs> Hey, look, count me out. I'm not going under no circumstances. I'm not to show we want to. <laughs> this jeep will get you anywhere, bruh. Good. Run. Lose the Daglo orange. I got enough explosives right here. What can I have? They get us. We get the board. Brian, now what? Well, I'm not going to get in that Jeep. Uh, no way. Get the hell inside! Now! There's no reason for him to shout at me! Right. Let's help him aboard, let's help him aboard! I've got 905. Every two hours, I want to hear from you. I'll be waiting by the transmitter. Good luck and bring that bitch back here. Bad. Yeah, let's move it out. All right! All right! Oh, we are going. Cool.
How's it going, Brian? I can make up a clear signal in that direction. Some kind of checkpoint up ahead. What? I count six soldiers. Six? Oh, God. Uh, hey, Mike, you said there's going to be no problem. Nothing's happened yet. Let's pull off here. I have an idea. <laughs> Check the cart. Yeah! Go! 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 because of my keen observation. No. Because we're a team. Yeah! How's it going, Bill? What, more bad news? That depends on how you take it. What do you mean? I just sent your movie crew into Cambodia to rescue Susan. What? They've got a pretty good chance of making it. You can't be serious. I've had enough. Let's pack up the whole thing and go home. Give me... Wait a Won't you give them 72 hours before you pull the plug? There are no soldiers. And time is money, Janet. All right. 72 hours. And not a minute more.
Chan, this is our present location. Yeah, that's right. the last gas. Okay, Chan, get some sleep. Keith, Robert, let's get some sleep. Mm -hmm. Smoothie Warriors calling Lippy Snake, come in. Smoothie Warriors calling Lippy Snake, come in. Susan Jackson. Mr. Price, Mr. Price, one minute, please. What is your reaction then? Of course, I'm very proud for them. In fact, I'm financing the whole rescue operation. Mr. Price, 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 is Mr. Price, I think you have enough for today. Just I still have a meeting with my director and Susan. goodbye for the day. Oh, oh, no. No. Mr. Price, Mr. Price, one Price. more question. Shit, lousy plate. Damn it. I hope I don't disturb you. It's just that, uh, I hope you don't find me insulting when I ask you to give me your autograph. I've had enough. Who do you think I am? You bring me to this goddamn cheap place just to ask for an autograph? Now get the hell out of my room!
That's it. We just used up our last drop of gas. Now where are we going to get involved? Wow. We're going to have to walk it from here. Ooh. Walking? Walking. Hey, this isn't dangerous. a Sunday outing. Let's go. Oh, we don't have much time. Walking is dangerous. You know, there could be enemies out there. If anybody would have told me that. Oh, don't be glad. You go ahead first. Checkpoint. Everybody hide. Tran, is there any other way to get around? I'm afraid not. That's the only trail. Don't worry. I think I know how to eliminate them. You wait. Mike. All right. Chan, check them out.
there should be a river in this valley. Yeah. Over there. Robert, if you want to join me, we'll go take a look. Yeah. Okay, sure, sure. Keith? Which way? Jan, you stay here with Lee and Brian. Let's go. Something like this is going to happen. Come on, hurry up. Wait. It's in a big camp. Oh, just great. Listen, guys, there must be another way. Ah, they have a truck. Good. Let's take a closer look, you guys. What? No, I'm staying here. You go on okay. ahead. I'm not going on, down let's there. Let's go. Let's go. No, there's an enemy down there. Go on ahead. <laughs> 
Wait! That truck is exactly what we need. There's a patrol leaving the camp. We can use them too. Lee, come with me. Right. I play bait for you, Michael. Come on, help me get their uniforms. Yeah. Robert, set up a smoke screen upwind of camp and make it thick. Jan, put this on.
Movie warriors calling Limping Snake, come in. Movie warriors calling Limping Snake, come in. Limping Snake, over. We are nearing our destination. No casualties. And we even conquered a new vehicle. Over. Good. Wait, Frank. There's something coming up. I'll call you back. Over. Right back there. Limpy Snake, come in. Limpy Snake, what happened? Roadblock, no problem. We estimate only seven more kilometers to go. Over. Roger. They're seven kilometers away from the car. You've got to admit that they're doing pretty damn well. Better tell them that the time is fast running out. Why don't you lighten up, Bill? I'm not pessimistic. I'm just concerned about my money.
Good afternoon, sir. We've been traveling a great distance, and we still have a long way to go. We we're hoping that you could be so kind as to sell us your buffalo and cart. No way! <laughs> Let's teach this guy a lesson. Okay, he deserves it. Yeah. Oi! Everything's okay. I got rid of him. Okay, <laughs> hook up the car. Yeah. disturb you so early. Yeah, what is it? I have bad news. My boss just called up and wants you eliminated. He says there's a rescue team coming. What? I'm in a real predicament. Our only chance is to go off. Just the two of us. Guys, I can hear Susan's voice. What? Give her the beat tone so she knows we can hear her. What was that? I think I heard something. Did you? Uh, about your plan. Just give me a little time to think about it. Sure. I'll have some clothes sent for you. Good day. Brian, if you're listening, when they brought me here, there were some mountains in the west and a river in the east. Please hurry. Shh, shh. She said a, a river in the east and a mountain range on the west. Jan, check the map. A mountain range to the west, river to the east. It <gasps> must be here. Yes, it's, it's not far from here. We are on the right way. Hey, good. Hey. Keep listening, Brian. I'll inform Frank. This is Movie Warriors calling Limping Snake. Over. This is Movie Warriors calling Limping Snake. Over. This is Movie Warriors calling Limping Snake. Over. Roger, this is Limping Deco. Just picked up Susan's voice. We're close. Over. Good. Let me know when you need the chopper. We'll check out the place first. Over. Roger, I'll let Bill know. Gotcha. Over and out. Yeah! Yeah! Yeah? The team has located Susan. What? Impossible. They're gonna need a helicopter to get her out. Do they have her already? Not yet. Okay. Stay with the radio. I'll contact the airport. Okay. You can take the rest of the day off. Thank you. Good day. Hello, this is Bill. I need a helicopter within an hour. No, I don't need the 12-seater. My small one would be quite enough. Jesus Christ, why 
Boy, that's an army camp. We just can't go in there. We'll have to put all our skills together. Okay, here's what we'll do. What's going on? Somebody's coming. That's perfect. Everybody knows what to do? You bet. Let's go. Wait. Let's go. Let's go. last chance. My boss is here. I should have killed you already, but I just couldn't do it. Come on, let's go away together. your gun down, or I'll shoot your little friend here. And don't worry, you can't expect any more help. Take them out to join the others. Need 
down there. Before my comrades here put a tragic end to your lives, I think I may owe you an explanation. Since our little movie was becoming a disaster financially, I had to act. So I decided to end the shooting in such a way that I could collect the insurance. Damn you! I engaged my Camier friends here, who I've done business with over the years, but they bungled the job. Otherwise, we'd never have found Susan still alive. You son of a bitch! Okay, shoot me. But who's gonna support you from now on? All right, you take command from now on. something out. Come on, just think. I could cut you in for a, for a split of the insurance money. Oh. It's a deal? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs>
Well, that's it. What do you think? It could be a blockbuster movie. Yeah, you've got that right. I will say I buy 400 prints. Oh, come on. 400 prints for a distributor? That's not a whole lot. How about 750? It's worth it. Come on, 750 prints, huh? Okay. I buy 750 prints. Okay. You got it. All right. Thank you. Thank you. All right. God damn. Woo! Yeah. Okay. <laughs> Thank you. You guys did a hell of a job. In the film as well as outside of the film. You did a hell of a job. I want to thank you. Thanks a lot. Yeah, it's too bad Susan couldn't be here. I guess she overslept again. <laughs> <laughs> That's kind of in keeping with her personality, isn't it? <laughs> so, what's next? Afghanistan? Yeah, I heard Reagan was asking us to do a movie about rescuing hostages in Beirut. Oh, that's even a better idea. I love shooting in the deserts. Deserts? I love shooting, period. <laughs> any place, any time, you got it. I'm ready. Thanks, guys. See ya. And I suppose I don't need this one anymore, right? right See ya. Right, right, right. oh, oh, yeah. yeah. Oh! 